गुड मॉर्निंग क्लास आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल प्लीज स्टे एट योर होम एंड बी सेफ ओके इन योर प्रीवियस क्लास वी हैव ऑलरेडी कंप्लीटेड आवर सेकेंड चैप्टर एंड टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट आवर थर्ड चैप्टर ओके बट बिफोर स्टार्टिंग द चैप्टर आई विल आस्क सम रिडल्स एंड आई होप यू ऑल विल गिव मी आंसर ओके सो रिस्पॉन्ड ओके my first question is what are the animals who has an incredible ability to fly i repeat what are the animals who has an incredible ability to fly that is birds okay now tell me this bird copies anything what we say name the bird which copy anything whatever we see that is parrot my second question is this bird hunts at night it can see very well at night that is an owl okay now this bird is mostly see in and around our houses this is black in color that is crow okay this is the national bird of india name the national bird of india peacock so here we can see that there are different kind of birds present in our environment they have different features okay now about birds so today we will discuss about your third chapter that is animal birds okay birds are an unique group of animals they have unique from all other animals because they have wings and feathers they have an incredible ability to fly understand so today we will discuss about your third chapter that is birds okay so open your book and read it with me in this chapter we will discuss about birds body parts like beaks feet feathers okay how birds fly food habit of birds nest of birds some special features of birds and caring of birds and animals understand There are different type of birds around us. Birds are of various color and sizes. Sparrow, myna, parrots, pigeon, quail are some of the birds that we commonly see in our cities. Understand? These are some common birds which we see in our cities. Eagles, kites, vultures and crows can also be seen sometime. you can see an image of eagle kites vulture crows okay and many other birds on your screen understand birds have wings as you can see and most birds can fly with the help of wings all birds have two feet and a beak birds do not have teeth birds have no teeth like we have teeth we eat food with the help of our teeth but birds do not have teeth a bird's body and wings are covered with different type of feathers as you can see on your screen an image of bird and you can see that birds have wings and covered with different type of feathers understand now we will discuss about a unique feature of birds that is beaks what is that beaks beaks of birds like we have mouth just like our mouth birds have also a mouth which is known as beaks okay a bird uses its beak to catch and eat food Or understand like we eat food through our mouth just like that birds also eat or catch their 
food with the help of their beaks understand it also uses it to feed its young gibbons birds also use their beaks to feed their young ones you can see an image of that on your screen build nest and clean itself the type of beak that a bird has depend on the kind of food it eats and the type of beak of bird is determined by the type of food they have eaten understand now we will see different type of beaks and birds like strong short and hard beak some bird has strong short and hard beak understand birds such as sparrow as you can see on your screen and pigeons have strong short and hard beaks like sparrow pigeons they have a strong short and hard beak to crush and eat nuts and seeds these bird eats nuts and seeds which are very hard that's why they have hard beak understand now strong sharp and hook beak like some bird has hooked beak like birds such as vulture hook like structure okay such as vulture eagle kite hawks they have strong sharp and hooked beak beak to tear and eat flesh they eat flesh normally vulture eagle hawk kites they eat flesh okay so that's why they have hooked beak similarly when now what is flesh a dead animal or meat understand similarly a parrot also has a short hook like beak a parrot have you ever seen parrot you can see an image of parrot on your screen a parrot also has a short hook like beak its beak help the parrot to crack nuts and peel through those skins of fruits and eat the pulp you can see an image of parrot when parrot is eating understand it break its beak also helps into climb trees parrot beak also help them to climb tree that's why these birds have strong sharp and hooked beak okay now we will see about a strong sharp and chisel shaped beak now what is chisel chisel is a strong pointed tool like structure which help birds to make hole in trees okay now just bird like woodpecker hoops they have a strong pointed and chisel shaped beak a woodpecker makes hole in the tree trunk with the help of its beak as you can see on your screen a woodpecker make holes in the tree trunk understand and live in that hole of tree trunk okay so this strong pointed and chisel shaped beak help them to make holes in the tree trunk with the help of its beak and pulls out and eat insects okay a hoops uses its beak to pick up insects from the ground they have very sharp pointed and chisel shaped beak so that they can put the insect from the ground as you can see on your screen now we will deal about broad and flat beak what is broad and flat beak some bird has broad and flat beak water birds such as ducks and geese have broad and flat beak as you can see on your screen ducks and goose they have broad and flat beak These birds take in muddy water along with insects, worms, small fish, and small water plants. Okay. 
they have a comb like structure in their beaks to drain out the muddy water as you can see on your screen they have their comb like structure on their beak so that they, they can drain out the muddy water now we will discuss about a different type of beak that is broad long and sharp is beak birds such as pelican who eat or who catch fish crabs frogs so that's why they have very sharp long and sharp is beak okay now long and pointed beak some bird has long and pointed beak like hummingbirds and sunbirds have long and pointed beak to suck nectar from flowers these birds suck nectar from flowers as you can see on your screen hummingbirds and sunbirds that's why they have sharp and long and pointed beak so today we have seen about birds that there are different type of birds on the basis of their different beaks on the basis of their different shape of beaks okay and they have different shape of beaks on the basis of their different eating habits okay in your next class we will discuss about feet of birds now that's all for today thank you have a nice day bye